Now, so what should someone do if they want to transition to tech or get started in the tech world? Yeah, Julia, thanks. That's a great question and uh, by far the most uh, popular question that I get. I think we are very lucky that we are in the, uh, in the tech field. And um, you know, there's so many opportunities. If you, you want to get a job, there's like uh, there are the remote opportunities right now. You can get a job in your own local, like country. If you don't want to get a job, you can freelance. You can start your own business. You can do so many things. Um, I, I think the way I like to boil this down is one thing you have to realize is that there are millions of developers in the world, and everyone has a different success story. So whenever someone asks me what's like a roadmap to get a job, there is no roadmap. Um, you have to find your own story. What we what we can talk about today is that maybe, maybe we can talk about how to find your own roadmap. Um, for that, I think there are two key points. Point number one is obviously you have to be skilled. Uh, you have to have a, if you want a job in some field, you have to know about it. You want to be a developer at a big tech company, you need to know about development. I think I don't need to elaborate on that. <laughs> um, so that's the first part. You have to figure out what you want to do. Uh, then you learn about it, study. And in today's world, there are so many things you can learn online. Uh, uh, most people choose like the degree, the degree path, which is also great. A couple of times degree. It's not mandatory. It's pretty good. So, you can uh, definitely learn anything online, so that's the first part. And the second part is applying whatever you're learning. So that's when you have projects, open source, like networking with people, and uh, in that also comes applying for jobs. Okay. If, you do, if you do just these two things, you'll get a job. And uh, that's how simple as I would like to put it. But it, it looks simple, it's simple to summarize, but it's it's not very simple to execute because you have to study, you have to give in the hours. Uh, mentorship can only take you so far if you don't put in efforts, you know, like yourself. So, yeah, get involved in communities. Always remember, just work hard. And then the second step is apply that somewhere. Because people should know, you know, learning in public does not mean having a you know, big following or whatever. Learning in public means building credibility. That you can do with 100 followers or 200 followers. You don't need 100,000 followers. Uh, when I got my first job, I had like 1,000 followers or something. So it's really not mandatory to have a big following. But yeah, work hard and apply that somewhere and you'll get You'll, you'll be fine. Yeah. Good luck. Yeah. And if I can add something, I think uh, being consistent is very important because sometimes you get very excited at the beginning and you want to do everything, to learn everything. Uh, but you know, try to focus on a, th a few things. Maybe learn the basics first, and be consistent. You know? So do a little bit every day, improve a little bit every day, and and you get there. Instead of you know trying everything at once, and then you burn out. So consistency is very important as well. Yeah, uh, it's the fourth C. <laughs> fourth C is consistency. Yes. <laughs> consistency is important. Uh, yeah, and the point about learning various things, um, it's it's good at the beginning, like when you're first starting out, because the more you explore, the more you know, like the things that you don't like. Um, and uh, there's this thing called Paishit learning, know everything about something, something about everything. So try out various things, see what you like, and then dive deep into it and get tools around it, learn more about it. But yeah, you don't have to be, you don't have to be an expert when first starting out. Just learn on the go and contribute. As long as you're making progress, you'll be fine. Yeah, thank you. Bye. <laughs> awesome.